Yo guys, your boy Orin here, how y'all doing? And in this video, I will explain how Timo Werner and Kai Havertz could turn into one of the most dangerous partnerships in Europe. Let's start with Kai's and Timo's position. Timo Werner mainly operates in that left hand channel and he likes to, you know, make runs in those channels, cut inside and, you know, shoot with his right foot. That's his specialty, um, creating space for his teammates and running into the free space. That is the best abilities that he has. And also with Kai, he plays on the right hand side in the similar areas, but more deeper. He has more, a more creative role and, you know, he can play up front. He can play on the weak and he can play in the middle which gives him a big big boost and you know basically wherever the team needs him he can play there in those attacking roles and Timo and Kai Havertz can be one of the most complimentary players that you've ever seen in the Premier League uh, let's say if you have like a 4-2-3-1 formation Kai can play behind Timo and you know when Timo maybe just plays like a false line role he can um, basically attack the free spaces behind Timo or let's say Kai is playing the false line role Timo can make those runs you know they are a very complementary uh, combination and they can work many many magical things in the Premier League before continuing the video make sure to drop a like comment and subscribe to my channel uh, it helps a lot and let's grow together Kai and Timo both could assist and score many goals. Kai scored 46 goals and assisted 31 goals in 150 appearances in Bayer Leverkusen and Timo Werner scored 95 goals and assisted 40 times for RB Leipzig. They are very able players and they can do multiple roles at the same time. By the time when Chilwell, Ziyech and Pulisic are available to play, Havertz will have a less creative burden on him and he will be able to attack the spaces in and around Timo Werner. As you guys know, Timo Werner um, is a pretty complete striker, but one of his weaknesses is the aerial prowess. And in this case, now that now we have Kai Havertz and one of the main strengths of Kai Havertz is his aerial ability. So that's why they are a very complementary partnership and they will be able to assist each other when needed. Kai's and Timo's versatility is a big plus for them. They can constantly switch position with one another and the opposition will be confused. And they can take advantage of this by attacking the spaces that are left behind by the center backs pushing to cover or defend against uh, Kai or Timo. And by exposing those free spaces, they can get a lot of joy out of it. As you guys saw, Timo and Kai are a very complimentary duo. By, by the time when Ziyech, Pulisic and Chilwell are fit, our attack will be transformed and they will have a much more easier time getting up to the pitch and combining with one another. And I truly believe that Timo can get 30 plus goal contributions this season and Kai getting 20 plus goal contributions this season and they can be a major, major factor for us to go to the very important stages of Champions League. I'm talking about your UCL finals and semi-finals and who knows, maybe winning it. And maybe with more consistency and more uh, better defenders, we can challenge for the Premier League and actually win it. I assume it would be realistic to say maybe we, have, we will have the ability to win the league next year. This year is just a year to build on from the last year, you know, get to Get, combine the new signings with the old players, you know, get them to have more chemistry with one another and next year go for that title. And these two will be the two major, major players that, we, that will help us to get there and they will be the poster boys for our new generation. 